Here's a sure sign spring is on the way. VCU's baseball season is underway. VCU Insights' Jeremy Hirsch previews the Rams' 2009 season. The Rams start out 2009 looking to forget a 2008 campaign, one of their worst records in recent memory. Coach Paul Keyes is focusing on the future. He says he expects to see more of the team that had been in the NCAA tournament six times in the past 10 years and not a team that went 15-30 and 30 last season. We're going to attack it like we're going to win. It's not a rebuild year. It's not a comeback year. This year is totally different than any other year we've had. Right fielder Justin Wright was a bright spot on the Rams roster last season playing in 42 of the Rams' 45 games, hitting an average of 311 with a career-high eight-game hitting streak. Wright hopes this season will be much better and hopes he and his teammates learned a few lessons from last season. Although we were losing at the end, uh, the guys were playing hard. And, like, individually, you know, we were never quitting. I'm here with Rams lefty Ian Thomas, where Ian is going to show me how to pitch as he and the rest of the team train and practice hard for the upcoming season. Ian? All right, man. All you're going to do, since I'm left-handed, you're right-handed. It's going to be completely opposite, all right? I step back with my right foot. Mm -hmm. You're going to step back with my your left foot. foot. Okay, you're going to pivot with your right foot. Bring your leg up. Now as you're bringing your left foot down, uh -huh. break your hands and you step out. You should be pretty much ready to roll over and just throw it. Throw it. All right? All right. Good on a catch for me? Yeah, definitely. All right. This year, the stadium, where the Rams play, the Diamond, is all theirs. They once shared it with minor league Richmond Braves, but the Atlanta Farm Club packed up and left town last fall. Aaron Morgan, who had an earned run average of 1.40 and 13 relief appearances last season, thinks having the Diamond all to themselves will help players and fans alike. Most colleges have their stadium, and before it was we're going to the Braves Stadium, but now I think we look forward as it's our stadium, so it makes everybody feel more, more at home and more comfortable with our surroundings. While hard work will be the key, Rams first baseman R.J. Shank, who hit a 308 batting average and appeared in 41 of the 45 Rams games, knows one more thing that will get the Rams rolling this season. It would be great to have a better fan base, but it's, it's kind of hard since we're off campus, but... I would love to see more people. It would be great to have the same opportunity the basketball team has with all the fans that they get. So it would be a great feeling. As the Rams get set to play their first game in Central Florida, they are hoping for a packed house when they return home. For VCU Insight, I'm Jeremy Hirsch. February 27th marks the first home game on the calendar for the Rams as they play Long Island. Game time is at 3 p.m. at the Diamond.